Seymour absolutely keeps me safe. In fact, he has literally saved my life. Seymour kept me from walking into the street right in front of a bus. If I didn't have him, I'm positive that I would have been hit by a vehicle that day. I don't know how they uh, can tell what I feel because when I'm sad, she knows that she comes up to me, put her chin on my lap and then wagging her tail and then that changed my mood. It's just a, a great feeling having her around. The confidence that I get, the, um, the loyalty, just her being a, a, a part of my life. My guide dog means so many things to me. He's like another, you know, having another child, but this child can definitely help me a lot more, you know, as far as crossing streets and, and weaving my way in and out of uh, other people at the grocery store. He means I can just walk out the front door too anytime I want to and go take a walk. It's freedom and independence um, personified, really. From the moment they are born, our puppies are groomed to be future guide dogs that will one day change lives. Our selective breeding program with its dedicated staff and volunteers helps each puppy to reach his mighty destiny. Aspiring guide dogs are ushered into the puppy program, the next stop on their journey to success. Molding these pups to be relaxed, calm, happy, and confident no matter the setting is our goal. After a year and a half of dedicated daily training by their puppy raiser, a guide dog puppy is ready for the next stage of his adventure. Promising guide dog candidates graduate into advanced training to complete their preparation. Training includes navigating stairs, avoiding hazards, and stopping at intersections. Our guide dog hopefuls have reached the end of their training journey. The next step of their adventure is about to begin. Quality guide dogs are partnered with blind Texans in the exciting culmination of our journey. Training together, learning from each other, and bonding along the way, our dogs are fulfilling their destinies. They provide the freedom to navigate with confidence, the ability to walk with safety, and the independence to live with purpose. My, my, my traveling, uh, when I go traveling, it's much easier, much, much easier with, uh, with Ziba. When, when I go somewhere, like when I go to Vegas, uh, if I travel by myself, um, all I need to do is have somebody show me where our room is, where we're going to have our meetings or whatever, and um, she takes over after that. I don't, I don't need a sighted guide to get to where I need to be. And it's, uh, 
it's a great deal of freedom and it, and it makes life uh, uh, very much easier. Actually, I did that when uh, Chiff left, left me unexpectedly uh, back on January 14th, uh, 2011. Uh, I uh, I, uh, my grandson was crying, and, and it was it was kind of difficult. And uh, I'd planted a, a Mexican sycamore tree, and I told him, I said, uh, "This tree right here will be here from now on, and that tree's name is Chip." And that made him quit crying, and it made me feel a lot better. Uh. Yeah, I am a different person because I have more uh, self-confidence because I can move with freedom uh, because she knows where to take me. And uh, I trust her that she will be uh, taking me where I want her to go or where I want to go. So I trust her and that gives me a self-confidence in myself. Uh, my guide dog is a uh, significant member of my family I have here in Austin. She's my uh, buddy, my best friend. Anywhere I go, she's uh, with me. And uh, she's my sidekick. I would certainly be uh, indoors a lot more. Um, I, I certainly would go out less. Uh, uh, and, uh, you know, Seymour saved my life before, so I've, um, you know, I, I, ho I owe him that as well. Um, without Seymour, I wouldn't have gone to a friend's wedding. Without Seymour, I wouldn't have. Uh, traveled to Louisiana and uh, uh, played at their casinos. Um, without, you know, without, without Seymour, I, I wouldn't have tried to go back to college. Um, very reluctant to leave the house. I didn't want to be out in public very much. Um, I had comfort at home, didn't want to take on the world, as it were, and just, uh, you know, kind of deteriorating into, uh, no, I'll be fine at home. You know, and, and it really didn't help at all. Uh, new marriage or uh, my relationship with my wife, and, and I definitely didn't want to be that kind of person with my kids so young and growing up. So I really needed to set a better example. and. Uh, I took the first step and called Guide Dogs of Texas, and it's the best thing I've done ever. <laughs>